Hello ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, this is Magnius and welcome back to another episode of The Long Dark. Now, it's starting to get dark. Not the long dark, not dead quite yet. Actually, we're doing quite well, we're pretty healthy at the moment, although we only have 47 condition. We are on the opposite side of this mystery lake, or whatever this place is called, the Lone Cabin. We're gonna check out this cabin, we found some newspaper. That's good. Uh, once again, having some frame rate problems inside of buildings, not outside, only inside. Doesn't make a lot of sense. Probably this freaking lighting. I bet the devs were like, oh yeah, that lighting, that lighting has to be beautiful, and I'm like, nope. Game just has to be fun, don't need to play around with crazy lighting, and there's absolutely nothing in here other than paper, okay. That's fine, we'll just, we'll just go back outside where our... Our frame rate is much better. See, look, look at that. Look how beautiful that is. No problems out here. So we already checked all of these little fishing ice holes. We got all sorts of nice stuffins. Unfortunately, what is that? I mean, clearly that's a wolf, but what is the ice thing? Oh, decisions, decisions. Should we go for the ice thing? Is that, is that actually just a piece of ice? I think that's actually just a piece of ice. Never mind, guys. My bad. What in the world are cattails good for, anyway? I feel like I've found several cattails, but I don't know what to do with them. Oh well. Let us check out these places. It looks like this is already burnt down. Probably not gonna find anything in that. However, these are still intact. Let's go inside, see what's inside. Goodies? Um, no. Oh, salty crackers, delicious. Always what I wanted, a fire log, nice. Fire logs are a little bit different from cedar firewood in that they are soaked in accelerant of some sort. Mmm, beaches. Best thing that you could possibly eat during a, an apocalyptic geomagnetic storm. Delicious peaches. There are no stoves or anything in any of these places, which is not good. It's not exactly a place I want to sleep. Not that I'm unwilling to sleep in them, it's just that I would I would like to have a stove as well. Be able to make some food. What is this? This is nothing. Wonderful. And we're stuck on a table. Come on, get inside. It's cold. You're dying. Um, once again, I see nothing particular- wait, what is that? Pork and beans! Mm, very good, very nice. Um, no? No? Oh wait, what is this? Matches! Okay, so matches are always nice. I'm glad that we found some matches. Unfortunately, once again, it doesn't seem to be that much useful stuff in here. All the cool stuff seems to be in the, uh, in the ice holes. The ice holes seem to have, like, knives and magnifying glasses, uh, fishing lines, all sorts of wonderful things. What is, what is this? Oh! Backpack and a corpse. No I will take your beef jerky. Thank you very much. I want beef jerky so badly right now. I actually just ate the very last of the beef jerky that my mother sent me from the United States. And thus... I'm craving beef jerky. If any of you have beef jerky, please send them to me in, in South Korea. I would very much appreciate that. I think that this area over here, which may have actually been the last place where I stopped recording, I, I discovered that if you exit the game out in the middle of nowhere, it will actually respawn you back inside of the last building you were in. Which is sort of unfortunate, I guess, for me, because I had to redo some stuff off camera, but regardless. What was that sound? Sounded like bones rattling. That's terrifying. So basically I think the main problem with the game in terms of survivability for me is that wood does not seem to be a renewable resource. As far as I can tell. Um it's true that you can forge for wood, you can scavenge for wood, but I've never gotten anything other than like Tinder plugs from that. Oh, what is this? A plastic container! What could... nothing. Wonderful. 
Um. Huh. Hello? So clearly there is nothing important in here. In any of these cabins. These cabins are useless. I did find a flare though. Not exactly sure what I would do with that. Other than try to scare away a wolf. But the wolves do not attack us in this difficulty level. So meh. Oh, I found me some firewood. That's good. Can always use some firewood. Nothing down there. Some work boots. Pretty sure I already have boots on, but, you know, can never have too many pairs of boots. What is this? Nothing. Nothing important. The wind outside is frightening. It's quite, quite strong. So far we've survived for 10 hours and 14 minutes. It's getting quite late. But... I think, I think if we're going to go to sleep, we should actually go to sleep indoors. Because I don't want to... Like... It's, it's true that I can go to sleep inside one of these cabins. But these cabins are not exactly well made for keeping me alive. I feel... Oh, well, the wind. The wind out here is... Oh god, it feels like negative 15. That's terrible. Alright, so we're, we're going to run all the way back to that camp over there. Which actually is... Quite a far way away now that I think of it. Our cold is going up like crazy. But we're gonna go back to the, uh, whatever that camp place is. Band camp. We're gonna go back over there with the flag. And we're gonna sleep in there for the night because I don't want to sleep in one of these little cabins. It's, uh, negative one degree Celsius indoors. Hopefully this one with a fire next to it, a stove right next to the bed, will be a bit warmer. Also, I don't know what time the uh, the sun officially rises. I'm gonna go with like seven, maybe eight. But now the question is, since we've exploited everything that's here, you know, not up in the mountains, everything that's on the lake, where do we go? Where do we go to get more stuff? Where do we go to find food and and shelter and more beans. We need a can opener. We need a can opener so badly. More important than that, wood. Where do we get wood? We need wood not only to cook our food, but also we need water. And water, we need to get that by melting snow and boiling it. Which you have to do both, by the way. Not only do you have to melt snow, but you also have to boil the water afterwards. Which takes so much time. It takes like an hour just to prepare one liter of water. Oh, get out of here, you, you mutt. Are we safe indoors? We're good. Oh, it feels like 7 Celsius. See, see, this is, this is the one that we should definitely sleep in. This is the good one. This is the nice one. Oh, look. A tin of coffee that I did not find earlier. Wonderful. Oh, in a drawer! I forgot about this, apparently. A rifle round? I, um, uh, do not need a rifle round, believe it or not. Because I do not- Oh! Hook! Maybe, maybe I should- Oh, no. This, this does not work. Fishing tackle? Does this work? 0.17 hours. Can I use a tool? Um, no. Begin crafting. Let's see if I can craft these together. Did it work? Fishing tackle! Wonderful! Alright. So... We have four things of line. I have a fishing tackle, which apparently only has 84% durability. That is not very nice. This magnifying lens is awesome. A pry bar? I don't know. I have no idea. Getting a little bit tired though, and it's windy as crap outside. We should probably take this opportunity to go to sleep. So let's go on upstairs. Hello, Mr. Body. Oh, it, it's quite cold up here actually. Hang on. Feels like... 3 degrees Celsius. Apparently he thinks this is warm. Our cold is going down. That's weird. 
Alright, whatever. But the beds are here, so, you know, I should probably sleep in a bed bed. Let's start up a fire. Oh, cat head tails, those can be used for tinder. Alright, I gotcha. Claimed wood, only 30 minutes. It's not, it's not good, actually. But oh well. 46% chance. That's definitely not good, jeez. 71% chance. None of these are very good. Oh well, let's try this. As my fire starting ability increases, surely I'll be able to make fires with normal stuff. And I failed. Miserably. Wonderful. Um... Let's try this again, using up yet another one of our matches. Come on. Come on. Make us a fire, you know you want to. Yes. Yes. Fire. This takes absolutely forever, I'm not okay with this. Okay, here we go. Yes? Wonderful. Only 54 minutes. Um, clearly we need to make this pork and beans because the durability is going down like crazy. So I'm going to go ahead and cook this. We can uh, use our knife to open it. And uh, this is also taking way too long, but you know, whatever. Let's see, where's our food? Hot and opened. Wonderful. We're gonna eat it. 600 calories. It's a lot of calories, actually. I think our meat can stay here for now. We should probably make some water, I suppose. Yeah, the meat seems to be doing alright, surprisingly. Oh, we are now encumbered for unknown reasons. Because we're carrying too much water, I guess. Venison raw. Yeah, I mean... Oh. Uh, guess we should put some stuff in here, huh? I could use this. Oh. Apparently I'm taking more stuff out. Not exactly what I wanted to do. I wanted to do this. Here we go. Okay, sort clothing. I don't think that I need a whole lot of clothing. This has 64 condition. This is 28. Okay, so we need a pair of gloves. Um, work boots. 1.6? 0.6. Okay, so clearly we should wear these, right? Let's, let's put on our boots. Where? Alright, wonderful. And I can put on these. And where? Do we not have on a winter coat? What is this? A thin wool sweater. Aha. Uh -huh. This is clearly better. This is much better. Holy crap, we're gonna wear this. Oh, apparently we can wear both. Huh. Interesting. I was not aware that we could wear so much different stuff. Okay. So, good for you guys. We are going to put all of this stuff in here. How do I move it? Let's do this. Nice. Okay. And we are wearing the rest of this, and we do not want to put it in there, because uh, that'd be bad. However, we do have a lot of... Uh, See, let's move over stuff that we would need to cook. Because we're not going to be cooking our venison out in the middle of nowhere, right? Right? I think. We can keep all of the food that we do not need to cook. We can, we can eat this wherever, right? Yeah. Okay, and I don't know what time it is. It's currently 9. Let's see, 3, 6. Let's sleep for 9 hours, I guess.
Yeah, I think that'll be okay. Let's see, let's see what that does. Crazy stuff is gonna happen. It's currently... We've survived so long, it's amazing. Uh, we are very thirsty. Very, very thirsty. Let's drink some water. Mmm, so much water. Drink it all. How much do we drink? We drink half a kilogram of water. That's like 1.1 pounds of water. It's actually not that much, all things considered. Let's go ahead and eat some of that beef jerky. Mmm, delicious. This is apparently running out. It's not good. Oh... Uh... We can forge for wood. We actually have a decent amount of time left. Even this to harvest. We do not have an axe, so we can't get a decent amount of wood. Let's do 40 minutes. What do we find? Two tinder plugs. See, no cedar wood. No real wood. We need real wood so that we can have real fires. Although, now that it's uh, a decent time of day, I think, if we go outside and check it. Oh, it's snowing. Wonderful. I want to fish. This is beautiful. Such a beautiful game. So I, I suppose that that way is east, right? Considering that the sun is currently rising. Must be east. I'm sort of afraid to leave this lake because I don't really know where I'm going if I go anywhere else, so... I just need wood. It's really all I need. I guess I need an axe to get real wood from foraging. So unfortunate. Alright, so let's go fishing on camera. So, I'm gonna use my knife and I'm gonna break this up. Break up that ice. Come on, break it! And now that we have our fishing hole cleared, we can go fishing. Hours to fish. One... Two... Let's just fish for one hour. I want to see what we catch in one hour. Apparently nothing. Let's fish for another hour. There we go. We got ourselves a fish. 489 calories. That is amazing. I enjoy fishing. Such a wonderful feeling. Another lake white fish. Mmm. Delicious. That is two fish that we have caught. It is currently freezing outside. We are very cold. We are going to go back inside. Maybe cook our fish. Just cause. Man. I I have no idea what I'm supposed to do to, like, progress in this game. I know there are other cabins that are full of stuff, but I have no idea where they are. We could just, like, randomly start walking out in some random direction. Probably wouldn't be very good for our survival. But eventually we may just have to. Being forced out into the middle of nowhere by the game because we're running out of firewood. It's so annoying. So very annoying. Wolf, I swear, get away from my home. Get out. You should not be here. I think this stove is just fine. Only 18 minutes. Accelerant. We only have one accelerant. Let's see if this works. 47%. Probably not gonna work, but... Miracles do occasionally happen. I, I think this is only 30 minutes of... a fire anyway. Let's 
game is made against us. There's no way we're going to survive. I just want to live long enough to eat a fish, that's all. Where's my lake white fish? There we go. Cook that lake white fish as our fire slowly dies. Come on, don't 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 die yet. Cook the fish. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Is this my lake white fish? Yes it is. And this is still raw. Oh my god. Okay, what is this? Ah, oh, the stalks. Tough, not very filling, but edible. Huh. Interesting. I'm gonna eat this first. Nom nom nom. Delicious. And... This is already cold. But I guess I may as well eat that as well. This has a way too many calories for me at the moment, but it's going bad. I should probably eat it soon. Stop infection from spreading. Useful for cleaning wounds. Constrict movement. Reduce pain from injuries. I have no way of figuring out how to increase my condition. Oh, it's already back up to 100%. Wonderful. Okay. That's good. Um, I need to drink something. Drink. Alright. And we're basically still alive, despite me being foolish and not knowing how to play this game. So, supposedly next episode we're going to go on some exploration and go up into the mountains and see if we can find uh, that radio tower. I think there's a radio tower here. But anyway, for now, we've gone fishing, which is probably one of the coolest things in the game in my personal opinion. Thank you so much everyone for watching. My name is Meganius, and I will see you next time.